everybody and welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for stopping by today I am here at the top of Squares Gateway and where the new promenade starts can you say sir welcome to Blackpool I have just been to Morrison's and I'll give you one guess guess what they didn't have in Morrison's yeah, that's right, I still didn't get my elusive coffee. But I did get a couple of things that I needed. Got a bit of milk. And I also got some peanut butter and pretzels Hershey's. Granted they weren't needed as much as the milk. Oh, and the bread. Because I've had no bread. But yeah. And somebody has asked me if I would do a vlog of the entire promenade showing all the hotels and everything. So I thought seeing as I've just done my shopping and I'm in the area, today will be a good day to do that vlog. Because then I can combine my shopping trip and my exercise walk all in one and only have to go out once today so anyway here we are promenade starts at stargate there's a tram there at the stargate stop that'll start up in a minute and head on to fleetwood that is Fremantle avenue and you can just about see down there if you zoom in on it the big one peeping out super quiet on the prom today hardly anybody walking about There's no hotels on this side yet there are some magnificent looking houses I'd love to live on the promenade but if I could choose well if I could choose I'd have one of those coastal point apartments or I'd live on the north promenade but these houses look beautiful there's a tram shed there see that tram again it's going to head off to Fleetwood very soon We're not at the hotel part of the promenade yet, but I was asked to film the promenade from the very beginning. This is going to take a fair few videos, folks, and I've also got to finish off my comedy carpet vlogs, but I won't be able to do any of them today. And obviously, I won't be doing the full promenade today because. It's too far of a walk. I'll probably do today's walk to Chapel Street, Central Pier, because that's not too far. And I'll also get to film what's going on with the filling in of the subway there. And then just walk home. So I'll be walking in kind of a loop. Again, just houses down here. You can hear the tram behind me, it's going to come past in a minute. You can hear that unmistakable tram sound. I do like the old tram sound better than the new tram sound for sure. There it goes. and look the day today on Blackpool Promenade and we've got all this space to walk on nice and quiet just the ideal place really to take a walk all these big houses with balconies and sea views 
can see the illuminations. Obviously they're not turned on anymore. And you'd be happy to know everybody that today I have plenty of batteries and plenty of memory cards. I'm not going to be caught out again like I was the other day. That the street is at the current place. And this lot of houses here is Crescent Court. I do like these crescents. I filmed one recently, in one of my very recent vlogs, when I did the Kimberley Hotel because somebody had asked me to film it. So I went down there and filmed that. So I guess I'll be passing that again as I walk upwards, or I should say northwards, northways. As I walk in a northerly direction, there you go, to the central pier. It really is an absolutely lucky day. And I know I'm on the actual street rather than the promenade filming out to sea, but I have filmed out to sea so many times and people have asked me to film the actual promenade itself and not on the seaside. We want the hotels and the houses and the crescent side. When I filmed the Kimberley before, I was looking at those bridges, places of pieces of grass in the actual present and I thought I could imagine people many many years ago having picnics there just enjoying the seaside and here we go folks we can see some hotels now there is the new Mayfair it does have a for sale sign on it though and all the hotels will be closed right now for sure because they're not allowed to open but there is the new Mayfair and as you can see there is a for sale sign on it next to the new Mayfair is the Carousel it's a big hotel it takes over around half, maybe just less than half, of the Crescent. The Carousel, a sleep well hotel. Weddings, events, celebrations. They have a celebration suite. Next to the Carousel is the Feng Shui House Care Home. And Next to that is the Trivelles or Trivelles Sea View. And next door to that is the absolutely gorgeous Coastal Point Apartments with that magnificent reef terrace. I've not seen it in real life obviously, I've just seen it in pictures. The ones on the corner are the ones that I like the best from the artist's impression I've seen because how all the sea facing sides are just all windows, floor to ceiling just imagine the view you'd get from there I think they're around £350,000 for a three bedroom something like that I'd have a Floor three bedroom one facing the sea. So, yeah, 400 million people watch my videos. I'll buy myself one of them. Passing now is Harrow Place. Harrow Place is already on the streets of Doctor Stories. Just going to swing back, take a final look. Coastal Point, 
that's going to be amazing in there and I am going to finish this video now start the next vlog obviously all these promenade vlogs will follow directly on from each other so for this one I'm going to say thank you so much for watching please leave me a like and a comment and please subscribe and I shall see you all very soon in the next one goodbye